Good morning, good morning. We are basically ready to head over to our customer up here in Colorado, just basically across the border. Got about 42 miles to go. And you can probably see that's a uh, beautiful sunshine there out there again. Oh, it's nice out here, I'm telling you guys. Especially you Canadian guys. Oh man, it's nice and warm down here, you know. But let's get on the road and let's make our uh, delivery. Well, guys, look at these weird formations of the rock or the earth or whatever it is. Yeah, that's interesting, eh? <laughs> yeah, it's got all kinds of weird uh, hills and rock formations up here, you know. I don't know how good the camera is going to be able to pick up the uh, mountains way up there on the right there. Looks like they even got a little bit of snow up there, but anyways, it's a lot of interesting things up here to see. That's for sure, especially for you guys that are following me, you probably haven't seen this area yet nor have I seen this area in a couple of years so it's definitely nice to come out here and get some beautiful sceneries again you know well guys we are just coming into Fort Colon Colorado yep I'm gonna go see if we can find our delivery place up here yes, everything is strange for me I wonder why they put these wooden things here uh, onto the right. I've always been wondering why they do that out here in the southern states. I see that in Texas a lot too, where they put stuff like that. In 1.5 miles, turn right on but East Drake Road. CR I guess 42. maybe somebody can answer that. Maybe Trucker Drupa can answer that to me. Because he's been around more than I have. Anyways. We'll go see if we can find our delivery place up here. Well, guys, we finished on loading over at that place there in uh, Fort Colon, Colorado. And now we are making our way down to uh, Salina, Kansas. Yeah, so we're going to go pick up a load there tomorrow. And then we are going to go back home to Steinbach. So I should be home for the weekend again. Yeah, that's super cool to get two weekends in a row or maybe even three weekends in a row off, you know, that'd be awesome. It's a gorgeous day out here again, not windy at all, it's beautiful, beautiful. I enjoy this weather very much, definitely. I even saw a few spots where there was even green grass already. In some of the fields I saw a little bit of green grass already, so that's nice. We are on uh, I-70 right now, going eastbound. Yep. Oh yeah, I enjoy it. We got 14, eh, no, that's not correct. We got 16 degrees Celsius right now. And that is beautiful. That's much better than it is up in my hometown. That's for sure. Here we go. Just had myself a little bit of a pit stop on here on I-70 in L-I-M-O-N, Colorado. I don't know exactly how you pronounce it, but now what do we got up here? Looks like a DOT sitting up here. Yeah. Oh well, as long as he leaves me alone, I'm good to go. Yep, he's gonna go sit there and watch everybody. Yeah. And it's beautiful out here, I mean. I can't complain one little bit. Colorado is usually getting all kinds of crappy weather, you know, and especially in winter. And it's gorgeous up here today. I love the scenery up here. Yep, 
and me a good bite to eat. Now we got uh, that behind us. We got ourselves a reload offer already. Told you guys about that a little bit earlier, but my pickup was scheduled for tomorrow at uh, 1 p.m. And I could actually make it there all the way tonight. So I uh, I went and asked dispatch if they uh, was going to try and get me an earlier appointment. So they managed to get me an appointment there for 10 o'clock. So that's good. That's very good news. That's a couple of hours earlier. That's less time that I have to sit and waste over there, you know. But here we are. Keep on rolling. Getting good fuel mileage. Going empty for... I don't know, it was over 400 miles anyway, this is close to 500 miles and I'm going to be going empty, so hey, well, I don't care, I get paid by the mile so, uh, they sent me over there, I get all these miles paid, so that's better for me plus I'm going to be home for the weekend, so that's going to be great well guys, my day is over yep I am stopped over here in Russell, Kansas. I'm about, uh, yeah, what's that say? 75 miles to Salina, Kansas, where I'll be able to pick up my load tomorrow. And then I'm going to go back to Canada, where it's a lot colder than it is right here. It was only plus three there this uh, afternoon. And up here it went up to 22 Celsius. Yep. It was nice out there. I could actually go out there without a jacket or a sweater or anything like that, you know. Where it was still nice and comfortable. But, eh, I don't have a whole lot going on today. But, hope you guys still enjoyed uh, today's vlog though. I think I'm gonna go watch me some movies or at least one movie I think that's what I'm gonna do because I'm not in any hurry I don't have to be there tomorrow really early technically they only scheduled me for one in the afternoon and uh, well ask dispatch if they could try and reschedule it so I could get an earlier and they managed to do that so thank you very much dispatch yes you did your job and that's good because now they scheduled me in for 10 o'clock so we will try and make sure we get there by 10 o'clock yep yeah so I guess uh, with that I hope you guys are having a good day and we will see you again tomorrow at 5 a.m. so thank you very much for watching have a good day